morning guys um today i will be doing a tutorial on um my easy peasy bracelet that's what that's what its name is the easy peasy bracelet it's a pretty easy bracelet it was just like this name says it only requires two pins and before I go any further into the tutorial, um, you should know that you have to know how to learn the, how to make the inverted fishtail. So if you don't, um, just go learn it. I'll probably put an inverted fishtail, um, tutorial down in the description box below, like Sarah Lynn Tees or something. I mean, so craftastics. But, yeah, um... So let's go straight into the tutorial. Okay, so like I said in the intro, um, this only requires two pegs. So you can make this on the monster tail on these two pegs or something. And you can also make this on the mini rainbow loom. Today I'll just be using two pegs on the rainbow loom. So yeah. And then you'll need a hook. Today I'm using a pink melt hook. And this bracelet looks best using two colors. Um, the two colors that I'll be using today are dark green. Some people call it flush green. I like to call it dark green. And you will need, um, I mean, I'll be using black, just black. And uh, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so to make this bracelet, I'll be using these two pegs. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it so first color that I'm gonna use is black so you're gonna apply this twisted next you're going to apply it on your next color ben I'm using a dark green ben and then you're gonna hook over one of the sides Today, um, I'm going to be hooking over the left side. Just that side. And next, I'm going to apply your next color of band. And then just apply it on top. Just get a little closer. Next, you're going to hook over this side. And then this side. So now you have two bands on this peg and one band on this peg. Apply your next color. Again on the side. And hook over this side. And now this is where it gets kind of like funky. Um, you're going to hook an inverted fishtail on this peg. Apply your next band. <clears throat> You're gonna want to start pulling this out because it'll start growing really, really fast. And then, oops, band flew off. Bottom inverted. Sorry, inverted. Next color, sorry if I block it when I'm applying the band. Then you pull over the bottom. Okay. Inverted fish tail. Sorry, it's gonna look kind of funky when you like start it, but no. It's gonna go better. Oh no! Okay. So next, you're gonna. Sorry. You're going to hook an inverted fish tail on this peg. Next. Oh no! Hmm. 
Man, bottom band. Inverted fish tail. Okay, so you basically just repeat this until you have it to the length of how long you want it. These I did to so they could like around my wrist. So this will not take you more than five minutes because this is a pretty easy bracelet. So when I'm done, I'll show you guys how to finish it up. Okay, so I'm back to show you how to finish this bracelet. So you should have one on one peg and two on the other. You're finished. So you're just gonna apply a band on these two pegs your last one and then take your hook hook over the bottom one and then the bottom two on these two and sorry I just got confused so it should look like this now and now you're going to take this off carefully Put it on your hook and attach a C clip to it. Oh, my, my rubber band fell off, so I just saved it. There we go. So then you take your C clip and you attach it right here. So, and then you just attach it to the other side, and you are done. I hope you guys liked this tutorial. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And hashtag it to hashtag Minnie Mouse Loomer on Instagram. And... I'll be sure to like it and, you know, answer the question of the video and I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye. I'll s please remember to hashtag it to Minnie Mouse Loomer on Instagram so I can see it and like the post again. I just want to remind you because I want to see y'all's bracelets because y'all guys are awesome. So, anyways, bye.